You know what time it is? It's TF Nation time. Insouciant long pigs, it is I, some of us G1, coming at you for a new sensation TF Nation video. Yes, indeed, um, it's 18 days, eight, no, it's 16 days away, that's what I meant to say, 16 days away, sorry, I've got, I'm looking at an old video, I said 18 days, where I paused it, but no, 16 days, 16 sleeps, peeps, um, can you tell I'm excited, because I am fucking excited, excuse the brightness of the glare, because I was recording on here, my battery died, and I've started a new video, and I've had to plug my phone in, so forgive the, the, the glare, I'll try and minimise it as poss much as possible, by doing, I still, still can't do it, <laughs> but yeah, so, what's this video about? Well, it's about TF Nation, obviously, from the title, um, basically, um, what is on your shopping list this year? Because I'm a nosy bastard. I know, um, I've said in previous videos, um, plus there's not been a lot of videos about circulating around at the minute. Um, because, I don't know, because I'm not tooting me on horn, me on horn when I say this, um, but I am, when I do videos, people do videos, and it's nice to see people do videos about, about their experiences and about the thing I, because the reason why I do these videos is only you could experience TF Nation your way, right? And what I mean by that is, is you can only see it through your your own eyes. And it's nice to see other people, how they experience it when they do videos, what they've bought and stuff like that, what panels they saw and what, you know, you know what I mean? Um, and it's a nice insight into that person. It's like... They've bought some beer there, so they've bought some animated figures and something like that. And it's it's nice to see. And it's also nice to sort of set up a timeline sort of in your head, sort of head canon it. Like, um, you know, um, you know, they're in the dealer room, they bought this. I was watching a panel, or I was in the bar, or I'd gone out for food, or I'd done this. And it's kind of like positioning myself, you know, in my head, you know, where they were at that time, if that makes sense. Um, you know, and it's just nice to see, it's nice to see people do it, and it really is, it's a really lovely thing to see, you know, what they've bought, and, you know, and and again, it's not a down to, um, how much you spend, or dick waving, like, I bought the most expensive thing there, or the rarest thing there, I mean, alright, I did a little bit with Black Zarak, but, I was more excited that I own it, that I own a black Zarak rather than the thing itself. It's like the rarest, one of the rarest Transformers, and I own one, you know? And it's kind of like, and I wasn't showing off. It was just the fact that I can't believe I own a black Zarak, you know, that kind of attitude. But, you know, like I said, it's not about how much you spend or, you know, how much you don't spend. Um, you know, it's, you could have £10 in your wallet all weekend and have a fantastic time, you know. Or you can have a thousand pounds in your wallet and have a fantastic time. It, the, the monetary value doesn't really matter. It's what you buy and it's what you choose to buy as well. Um, you know, do you buy new stuff or old stuff or a mixture or in between stuff, you know? Um, and it's just lovely to see people do it and it's nice to see, you know, like I, I mean, one of my more favorite things after the events finished is watching the video start to roll in. It's like, and this is what I bought. Because I like calling it swag. It's a swag video. Because um, we've got a TF Nation haul. I used to say haul, but now I've changed it to swag. It just sounds better. My TF Nation swag, you know? Um, because. And another thing as well is, with, with these videos, is you don't see much of it. Although the T, the guys that go to TF Con are starting to do it, but their videos seem to be the same. They walk around the dealer's room and that's it. And it's like, oh, I'm going to TF Con today. And you might see him walk into the plane or the car and driving and stuff like that. That's fine. That's great. But tell me what you did there. Don't just show me the dealer's room. The dealer's room's fine and great, but I can't see what's happening because I'm at home and you're just looking at toys, which is, again, fine. But at the same token, though, tell me what you do. Like, uh, Bert the Stormtrooper and... Um, I think it was Bert the Stormtrooper. 
and um, Patriot Prime had them um, chip challenges where they had the the, the most the most um, hot uh, crisps, you know, like Doritos. It's like Dead Man's um, Fingers or something like that. It's called. Um, and they did a video of that. Was it not last year? Year before, maybe. Um, it might have been last year. Um, yeah, stuff like that. I like to see. You know, they're all sat in the bar and they've all got these fucking, <laughs> fucking deadly crisps, and watching them do it. And ah, oh, it, it was it was so much fun. It was so funny. Um, I love spicy food, so I'd have been fucking right there. You know, I'd have got a new bunch of pussies. Give me one of them. <laughs> so yeah. Oh yeah. Need a, need a drink. It's got a little bit of whiskey in it. Just a little bit. Um, so, then, then so. Um, I've got completely off track. Oh, yeah, videos. Um, so, yeah, so let's see some videos. Come on. Um, let's see. Um, so, shopping list. That's what it is. So, I am on the lookout for some G1 stuff. I want I want a completely 84 line, so I need a side swipe, blue streak, wheel jack and a trail break. I know some of them have been reissued, so I'll be able to probably get them. Wheel jack, it's wheel jack and blue streak are the problem because blue streak is getting rare, rare to buy even the um, I've noticed even the reissue same with smoke screens getting added to, added to find at the minute as well I'd like to get smoke screen um, some, but I want some later G1 stuff I'd like to get some G, G1.5 as it's called, so I'm not quite G1 but not quite G2 either, so somewhere in between that um, some machine wars, um, just a bit obscure stuff. And I'm going back to Unicron Trilogy stuff because I regret every day selling my Unicron Trilogy stuff and it pains me. I've got a few bits here and there, but it pains me because there's some great stuff in that, some garbage as well, but some great stuff in there. Um, I just want to vary my reviews a bit as well because I don't mind doing G1s and, and stuff, but it's nice to... Because I'm not... Come back into my channel, which has 790 subscribers, by the way. Um, well done, thanks for subscribing. Um, no, but what I mean is, is I'm not about the, f the the first person that does a video about the latest figure that's out. You know, I, that doesn't bother me in the slightest. It, I mean, I have done it. I have been once. I was the first to review a figure because I've just been playing with it and I thought it was great and I'll talk about it. And that's the thing. Um, if it's a new figure, a new figure, new figure, fine, I'll play with it and thing. But nine times out of ten, you know. You can buy that figure, you know, easy, fairly easy, but it's an older figure that I like to review, you know, and and something a bit obscure, a bit weird, um, because I think the the weird ones are the shit figures. Because I've just done Generation One Quit Switch, and people seem to all like that video, even though I did it before. I did a better video this time because my new style, you see. Um, yeah, I I just like doing obscure stuff. I mean, not not particularly rare, but a bit weird and a bit wonderful, you know. Um, so yeah, so I want to get some more stuff like that. So if anybody's got any suggestions, put them in the comments. Or make a video yourself and tag me in it. Um, yeah, so I want to get some late G1 stuff like some more Pretenders, some more Action Masters. Even though they're getting more, they're getting rarer to find. Not impossible, a bit, bit, bit rarer. Um, and I'd like to do the Action Master Elites, but they're fucking expensive. Um, and, and, and it pains me, like... About five or six years ago, you could have gone for next to nothing, but now they're going for stupid money. Sorry, ten years ago, they'd have gone for stupid money. Because there's only four. Now, let's see if I can remember the other. There's Double Punch, who is definitely supposed to be Black Zarak. Right? Um, there is... Oh, no. Windmill, which is a silly name. Uh, who is a helicopter. The, for those of you who don't know, the Action Master Elites are the Action Masters that transformed. Omega Supreme was another one. Either nobody knows what happened there. It's, if it's a new character, but or it's a misspelling, it's just Supreme instead of Supreme. And the color scheme's a bit weird. Um, and these have all our spinny gimmicks in them. And oh, what's the other guy called? Looks a bit like Bruticus, but all in pink. Because we've all got mad colors as well. Um, not double punch. Clutch, I want to say. Oh, I can't remember. There's four of them anyway. Um, so yeah, there's 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 um so there's those. I don't think I'll get those this year, but you know, so some of the later stuff like some I definitely want some G two stuff because G two was just crazy, um neon fucking fueled nightmares. <laughs> um, 
because my last G2 video, well, I've only got I've only got a couple of G2 figures. Um, where is it? Um, oh, it's going back a while now. Um, oh, there we are. Oh, 99 views. Um, so I've just got my YouTube channel. Over there. The plan was to have my YouTube channel blasted around so you could see it and subscribe, hopefully. But no, um, but no, it, it's it's. Oh, I can't remember what I was talking about now. Just thinking of myself. Oh yeah, G two. It's just a bit weird, and I kind of want a bit of weirdness, you know. Um, I definitely want a G two Megatron. That is definitely on the fucking list this year, and I'd love to get some. Like I said, some more Unicron trilogy stuff. I'd like to get some of the shit ones, you know, like um, is it Energon Ironhide? That guy. I know it's an awful figure, but I'd want it. But then. You know, this is the, this is the kind of line it is. That's an awful figure, and then it jumps to um, Energon Rodimus, who is a fantastic figure. You know, um, because last year, oh, I can't know which it might have been in demand. I can't remember. Um, one of them had a big pile of crap, basically movie stuff mostly, and I'm sifting through it. It's all half price as well, and and I'm sifting through it all, and I came across uh, Armada Sideswipe. Which is an awful figure. Um, Amada Scavenger, which I love, but everybody says, says it's an awful figure. You're all wrong. I love it. It's a great figure. And um, Cybertron Dirt Boss. That is a fantastic little figure. I've never had that back in the day. It's a fantastic little figure. Transforms well. It's Oh, shit. Everything's falling down. It's satisfying. It's uh, And it looks cool as well. The gimmick is daft, but, you know, it's got a great colour scheme. Brilliant. I reviewed it. I have to go, to go check it out. So, yeah. Um, I want some Studio Series. I don't want the Studio Series Dinobots, but they're getting expensive to find. Um, uh, so, yeah. So, yes. So, I'm going to end the video there because we're talking... I'm just rambling on now. So, tell me what's on the list. Tell me, you know... Um, just make videos, come on, do some videos. If you've got an idea of a, th of, a, of, a, of a thing to say, say it. Come on, bring it on. But no, um, yeah, I just thought I'd just do a little bit of a ramble and, and stuff video. So anyway, um, that's me. That's this video. Check out my um, Patreon, which uh, should be up here, I think. One, one of those. Um, my tier, I've got some cool rewards over there. My Transformers reviews and like, share and subscribe and all that good stuff and I will catch you all in 16 days in person yes uh, I was going to get some t-shirts printed up but I haven't had the time or the money to do it um, so yeah so yes anyway okay that's me done I'll catch you all very soon bye for now